Welcome back to another episode of Mythical Mayhem. Try saying that five times fast, it is difficult. Last episode, we built this wonderful, wonderful tower, but we don't have much going on in it. We have a few magical things going on, but I think we need a little bit more. And I've been having some terrible problems lately. Look at all of this. It's awful. All of these chests. Awful, awful, awful. Bleh. Don't like it. Luckily for us, we have magic on our side, and I have figured out a way, through reading some old scriptures, how to make something that'll solve my problem. These here are covalence dusts. They are going to help me. Big time. The high and low covalence dusts are made from carbon of different varieties, but the medium covalence dust, which is important, is made out of redstone. Now, redstone is this magical dust I found underground, and it is full of uses. We have a few uses here today for it. First, let's solve our storage problem. We're gonna need a diamond. Oh, that's, that's, a, that's a lot of power. It doesn't matter. It's fine. Some iron some stone, and a chest. We use a philosopher's stone to craft up an alchemical chest. Make sure the transmutation table learns this. And now, our storage problems are much easier to deal with. But that's not all this magical dust can do before it can do something even greater. If we take two each of these dusts, and we put some string with some paper, we can make a talisman. And a talisman is very useful, but this one is a repair talisman. With this, as long as I have it on my person, all of my items will start to restore. Now we can take the influx of magical energy around us to repair items back to their full potential. For instance, this pickaxe will be restored to how it was originally made, at least according to my mind. And you can already see all of my tools are being repaired. It's a slow process, but it's well worth it. Now that we have this type of storage, we can actually use it up here. Like so. I've been thinking about having this area here be the library where I keep all of my work, all of my books, all of my enchantments, all of my, well, spells and study areas. I could put a desk there, a desk there. I could put the desks together because we're gonna be doing a lot of writing if we're gonna write some spells. Speaking of spells, I actually found these two spells and while I haven't tested this one, I know exactly what this one does. <laughs> I found this spell in one of the abandoned chests laying around I still don't know quite what a plague is, but it's really handy. Because everyone gets scared and leaves and they drop these. I think I should pay the dragon a visit. It's been a while. Dragon! Yes? Hello? Dragon! Hello? Hi, you what? build so fa- Hi. You're so big. Yeah, I got big. Dragons grow fast. You're so tall! I'm very I... tall. Very tall. I didn't know dragons grew that fast. What What are you building here? Um... I'm building a restaurant. Oh! Place to buy food. Buy? Yeah. I make food. What's and buy? then you come here, and you trade stuff for food. So I could give you this, and you'd give me food? Ooh, I'll accept it, yeah. What do you want for food? Uh, I actually want to show you a spell that I learned. Oh! In celebration well, here, of you um, building... your um lum 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 lim lum lum back. The um lum 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 lum? I don't know. I don't... I don't... You can read that? To celebrate you building this rest... rest... restaurant... restaurant? Restaurant. Restaurant. How about this? Pretty sparklies! 
spark. Oh, they went away. Teddy spark. Sparkles. I found it. You found the spell? Mm hmm. This That's plague so cool. thing is very, very handy. Everyone leaves their homes and they leave all of their stuff there. And then we can take it. Oh, yeah. They're not there no more. That's right. Wait. What's this thing? Uh, it's a kitchen. See? Kitchen. Has all my stoves. What's a kitchen? Has kitchen. Ki kitchen. Kitchen. What's a kitchen? Kitchen. You cook food in it. See, look, I have a pot. This and I is where it. you make the tasty things. Yes. You're so big in here. I am the biggest. Ha ha ha. Yep, I'm gonna. There's a cookie jar here. I'm gonna fill with cookies. Uh, there's. What's a cookie? Um, counters. Ooh, I gotta make you a cookie. I don't have the stuff for cookies. Oh, I can make you cookies. Do you want cookies? Yes. Let's go! Your wings are huge! And big wings, yes. Big wings to carry the dragon. Okay, so I take some cocoa. And I replant the cocoa. Cocoa? These are cocoa beans. They don't taste good. You can't eat them like this. They're really bitter. What you gotta do is mix them with things. So like in here, I'll take... Yeah, what is all of this? I know this is all oh. farm stuff, but I don't... Like, all of this is new. Okay, so I have lots and lots of stuff on the farm, yes? Uh-huh, So I made uh -huh. a storage cabinet. I made a storage cabinet. And I put all of the foods in the storage cabinet. So each one of these is a food. Oh. And that solves the tummy problem. Yes. So we've got things like, I can make coffee. You probably never had coffee. I will I will get, make you some. There's tea. Tea is very tasty. Um, there's lots of berries. I really like berries. Tea sounds stolen. I don't know why. This is sweetberry, this is elderberry, this is blackberry, this is raspberry, this is strawberry, this is cranberry. Where do you um, grow the cookie? Um, oh, I don't grow the cookie, I make the cookie. I gotta go to my oven. Oh. I keep forgetting it takes you a minute. Actually, I've been getting faster ever since building the tower. Oh! Can I ask why the floor is covered in coins? It's a bed. <gasps> I... See, watch. I can't sleep here. It's a bed for dragons. I do sleepies. Okay. Cookies. I'm not hungry. Oh, well, when you're hungry. Mm hmm. I eat, eat this. the cookie and. Yes. When you're hungry, you eat the cookie. And I can come over here and get cookies anytime I want? Uh, sure. I'll make a bunch and save them for you. Uh, the sad human said this is valuable. Oh, yes. Coins will work. Uh, cookies are very, very easy. So, I will say, if you want a stack, you have to give me two copper coins. Oh. They're very easy. I'm gonna put some... I'm gonna try and do some more of the... the the building thing and also progress more. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna do some magic stuff. Okay. I am going to finish this. At least the basics. 
And I might dig up some of this ground here, too. I'm looking forward to seeing how this turns out. Yep. Bye, Shane. <laughs> Lemscraft is partnered with Nitrado. If you want a gaming server to play on with your friends, you can check out Nitrado and use the first link down in the description. Thank you, Nitrado! Nitrado. Dragon is adorable. We should probably start studying the written magics more, and to do that, I'm actually gonna need something called a desk. Dask, dask. So apparently the passages in the books I've read said I should make it like this. I've made a scribing table. We shall put it here for now. And with this, I should be able to make more glyphs, which go in here. Now let's put the book down, and what glyph do I get? I could do all sorts of glyphs. Magic is a wondrous, wondrous tool that can be used for almost anything. I just have to think about what exactly it is I want, concentrate, and then get to work. Now, what is it we want from the next spell that I make? Conjure Mage Light. That looks like a good one. So in order to conjure Mage Light, I just need these materials, and then select and place the materials on the table. A light glyph. And now I should be able to make another spell. I flip to page two. Let's go with projectile, mage light, lem light, create. I should really make an area to test spells outside. Let's try here. It's so tiny. It's like a little heartbeat. They're so tiny. Now I can make light. Well, I always could. One of the spells would be useful right now. Hmm? What's this one? Take these and... Glyph of Ignite. Let's go touch Ignite and I'll label it Ignite. So what does this do? Oh. Oh. Okay. Dragon. Yes? I made a spell. Made another spell? Mm-hmm. Look. Okay. Look, look, look. Isn't it pretty? Why are you lighting my stuff on fire? What? Don't light my stuff on fire. But it's pretty, look. It'll burn my logs. Oh, it does? Yes, it kills the- it kills the wood. It burns the wood and it goes away and it's sad. Oh. Can you put it in the table afterwards? You put it in there? The- Put what in there? The dead wood. No, it goes away. It burns up. Oh. Fire makes it crumble to ash. I made another spell. Okay. Uh, hmm. Uh, it's this one. Oh, it's a little light. It's so pretty. Hello, light. Mm hmm. I will not use that spell again. Mwah. I will use this one all the time. Okay. You can light you can light the fire on um on stone. Oh okay. Alright. Um <clears throat> Hmm. 
Dragon, do you have tools? Yes. Um, I have a couple. Are your tools broken? Um... Wear this. Okay. Now all of your tools will slowly repair. Oh, that's cool. Mmm. Inventory problems again. Even with a backpack. Okay. I think I need to solve more inventory problems. We can grab another alchemical chest. Some high-end covalence dust. And some wool and make an alchemical bag. This is so much better for storage. This should help solve some of those issues. Hmm, I don't feel like I know enough. I've already read everything here, and I've read some of the humans' books, but I can't keep going over there and reading them all. But I need to progress. I need more power. I need a lot more power. And the way I've been learning it at the moment is to simply research all of the literature I can find. So, in order to get more power, I just need to find more abandoned houses full of magic. Now, if I use this spell, I should be able to see all of the ley lines. There. And if I fly along these ley lines, I should be able to move way faster than normal. Where are the human structures? Is this one? No. That's a ruin. That was before the plague. Human structures. Does that mean there are humans nearby? I've never seen a human structure like this before. There are actual humans here? Um, hi! Um... Uh, no, I don't want to trade. Would you let my friend Dark eat you? I don't think they can understand what I'm saying. What's this? <gasps> they have magic gems here. Excuse me, this is mine now. High magical energy. Uh. Hi! Uh. You have magical stuff I need. I'll be back to see you. Uh, more magical gems. This is his magical setup. There's all sorts of stuff in here. Mine, 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 mine. You know, I don't think they'll mind if I just And these are mine now. What kind of building is that? I don't know what this place is, but it kind of burns. What's that? A beast the uh, re? A small tattered note clings to the binding of this bestiary. It reads, This manuscript is meant to be a guide for those who like to inform themselves about the greatest wonders in the supernatural realm. Okay. Huh. It's not complete, but this is valuable? <gasps> Wait, what's this? Bestiary lectern? Pixies? Ice dragon? I can learn more things from this? I will take it. Wait. 
Silver and gold? <gasps> this place has the best stuff. I don't like how that room made me feel, but I liked all the stuff I got from it. Oh, I think I understand why that room made me feel weird. This place has an anti-magic thing to it. Why? Why would you be anti-magic? That's not okay. Made my energy hurt. Wait, there are two more of them. Do both of them have anti-magic properties? Well, they have the same coins. And manuscript papers. Well, I think I've seen all you have to offer humans. Bye bye now! Bye! An abandoned human home. Right on the edge of whatever this is. Huh. Oh! <gasps> Water! There's magical items here! Uh oh. No, 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 no. Don't rain. No, 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 no. Oh no. What is that? Um... Uh... It looks like... Dragon? Why does it look like dragon? Like dragon but much bigger. And thinner? Hey. Hey. Do you know my friend Dragon? You two look alike. You're not talking. Are you sleeping? Do you know Dragon? Oh, you're doing the dead thing. Oh, sorry. I'll... Hmm. Should I put you in my table? Nah, no, I'll leave you there. And then me and Dragon can come back over here. And Dragon can see you being all dead. Bye bye, creature that looks like Dragon. Dragon! Hi, Dragon! What? Hi, I went exploring. And I found a lot of Hi. magical stuff. And I found, uh, I found a big version of you. Oh, you did? Uh-huh. You found one of the big dragons? They're also called dragons? Yeah, it's a dragon. Yeah, they were laying on the floor, and they were- they- they weren't saying much, they were just kind of laying there, and they looked really thin. Oh, they're, uh, they're super angry. Oh, thin? Mm -hmm. Wait. They didn't attack you? No, I thought they were doing the sleeping thing. Oh. Uh, no, um, where, where did you happen to find that? Oh, I could take you to them. Yes, one second. I can't believe um, it, a dragon's gonna meet another dragon. Well. Do you think you two have a lot of common? Well, I don't think a whole lot in common. Armor? Yep, oh, armor wow. done. Do -do -do. I don't like it. It looks funky. But I, I don't have amazing. iron yet. I can't wear iron yet. Oh. I don't- I'm not very strong. My endurance is bad. Okay. This way. Told you I've been getting faster. 
You have been. My goodness, you're flying faster than me now. <laughs> Over here, dragon. Oh. Look. No, we don't have much in common at all. He's oh. big, though. He got really old. Oh, this is an older dragon? You did good. You're a good dragon. They're not saying much. Well, that's because they're not, um, alive anymore. Oh, they are doing the dead thing. Can I put them in my yeah. table? Um, I don't think so. Oh, oh hang uh, on. Okay. I'm very cold. Hang on. Let me sit in a nice warmer spot. Warm? Warm. Oh, careful. Leaves. Oh, right. Put it, put it in this corner. I think it'll be good. No. Here. There. Oh, sorry. Here we go. Okay. Um, yeah, that was an adult dragon. Oh. Are you it gonna was. get that big? No, I'm a different kind of dragon. Hmm. There's different kinds of dragons. There's ones that are, like, lizard-like. Kind of. They have, like... Um, they're made of flesh and bone and stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm made of, I'm made of diamonds and plants. Yes. Okay, I have so one question. So they're a question. little different. Yes. What's a lizard? Oh, um, an animal, kind of? They wouldn't like it if you call, if you call them a lizard, though, so don't do that. But, um... They're made of, like, the same thing people are made of. Meats and stuff. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah. I got you a book. A book? Oh, that's oh. right. I, f I almost completely forgot to tell you. I found a village of humans. Oh! Mm -hmm. Where? Mm -hmm. They they couldn't talk or anything much. They they pretty much went, huh. And, and they tried to trade with that's me. All and then do. I took all of their stuff. And, uh, I also took this book from them and a bunch of gold and stuff. Oh. Do you want me to show you where oh. the humans are? So you can eat them? Be scary. Um, maybe. Book. Oh. Is Do you that not for want you? it? Oh, I, I, if you were giving it to me, I'm sorry. Mm hmm. I can show you where the humans are. Okay. They are in that direction. This direction? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, 